For our project, Geography of My Belongings, we chose to study where popular clothing brands are coming from around the world. We chose Nike shoes, North Face West, Patagonia fleece, Adidas pants, and H&M coat. This map shows where these items come from and where those companies' headquarters are around the world. We chose to research Bangladesh because many of the manufacturing companies have factories located there. Bangladesh is home to over 2 million ethnic people belonging to 27 ethnic groups. The largest of the groups, the Chamaka, has about 4,500,000 people. The second largest group, the Marma, has about half that with only 202,000 people. The oldest of the 27 ethnic groups are the Chantels. The Chantels have been living amongst nature for thousands of years and have sometimes been described as nature's children for the way that they give to the earth so they can take. The most followed religion of Bangladesh is Islam, making up 89.5% of the population, followed by Hinduism with 8.5% of the population. Buddhism and Christianity together make up 0.9% of the population. In 1972, Bangladesh became the first South Asian country to constitutionally proclaim secularism after gaining independence from Pakistan. Secularism is defined as the principle of separation of government, institutions, and people mandated to represent the state from religious institution and dignitaries. Bangladesh is a country located in South Asia. It is a part of the Developing Eight or D8 organization, which includes Egypt, Indonesia, Iran, Malaysia, Nigeria, Pakistan, and Turkey, who cooperate towards common socioeconomic goals. It is the eighth largest country in the world with 168 million people. In terms of size, it is just smaller than Ohio. With 1,100 people per square kilometer, Bangladesh is the most densely populated nation in the world that has a population of more than 10 million people. Over much of the country is located on the Ganges Delta in the Bay of Bengal, which leaves many vulnerable to the flooding that comes with monsoons. 75% of Bangladesh is less than 10 meters above sea level, and 80% of the land is technically considered floodplains. Bangladesh is the world's largest exporter of clothing after China. Garment exports are the backbone of Bangladesh's industrial sector, accounting for more than 80% of total exports and surpass $18 billion in 2014. These factories in Bangladesh are often located in unsafe buildings originally constructed for residential purposes. In recent years, a series of factory accidents have killed over 1,000 workers. In 2013, an eight-story building collapsed in Bangladesh's capital, Dhaka, leaving 87 garment workers dead. This was one of 5,000 garment factories of Bangladesh that are not compliant to safety measures. If they were operating in the US or the UK, they would have been told to shut down immediately. One direct relationship between the United States and Bangladesh is the fact that Bangladesh is one of the biggest producers and exporters of American products. Before this project, our group knew little about the country. We learned that the textile factories in Bangladesh operate under very poor and unsafe working conditions. The workers' extremely low wages, coupled with an extremely high population density, leads to 31.5% of the population living below the poverty line, which in turn is one of the leading factors of the country's malnourishment problem.